Good Will Hunt and Monologue, take seven. <laughs> of course, that's your contention. You're a first year grad student. You just got finished reading some Marxian historian, Pete Garrison, probably. You're going to be convinced of that to next month till you get to James Lemon. Then you're going to be talking about how the economies of Virginia and Pennsylvania were entrepreneurial and capitalist way back in 1740. That's going to last the next year. Then you're going to be in here regurgitating Gordon Wood talking about, you know, the pre-revolutionary utopia and the capital performance effects of military mobilization. Wood drastically underestimates the impact of social distinctions predicated upon wealth, especially inherited wealth. You got that from Rikers, working at Essex County, page 98, right? <laughs> yeah, I read that too. Were you going to plagiarize the whole thing for us? Do you have any thoughts of your own on the matter? Or do you? Is that your thing? You, you, you come to a bar. You read some obscure passage. Then pretend. You punt it off. As your own. As your own idea. To impress some girls and embarrass my friend. <laughs> See the sad thing about a guy like you. Is that you're going to start doing some thinking on your own. And you're going to come up with the fact that there are two certainties in life. One. Don't do that. And two. You dropped 150 grand on a fucking education you could have got for a dollar and fifty in late charges at the public library. 